I have got an idea for a burlesque routine. It will be so awesome. My costume will look amazing. My dance moves so sexy. The audience will just love it and I'm gonna be booked with this 100,000 times. Welcome to my video, the six steps of the creative process. This creative process is really important to know for every burlesque performer. Because every time you are creating a routine, you are going through these six steps. This is awesome! This is tricky. This is shit. I am shit. This might be okay. This is awesome. So knowing about these steps in the creative process will really help you so, so much with finishing your routines. Otherwise, without not knowing it, you're risking to lose your routine. So stop it before you have even finished it. And this would be such a pity because at the end it will be awesome. <laughs> so, every burlesque routine you create starts with the wonderful idea you have. You imagine the perfect routine and yes, then you start making up your mind what you need for your routine. First, you need a song. This song should fit perfectly to your routine and you should love it because then you can really dance very sexy to this song. The second thing you need for your routine is of course your costume. You should make up your mind which costume pieces do you want to have in your routine. Which props do you want to use? Where can you buy all these things or can you do something on your own? And the third important thing for your routine is of course your dance. So how you want to build up your routine and what you want to do. Yes, and then you start creating your routine. You are looking for a song, you are trying to make your costume with all the little details you didn't even think of and sooner or later you will realize this is so tricky, there's so much to do and, ah, and I do not really proceed. So it gets trickier and trickier and sooner or later you will be at the point where you really hate everything and you are asking yourself why am I doing this? This is all shit. So welcome to step number three in the creative process. And this is a really dangerous step because here you are really risking to lose your routine. So here you are really risking to stop going on. But when you are aware or when you become aware that this is a part of the normal process you are going through, you can just relax. So I will show you on this little graphic here. It starts with everything is awesome and this is amazing, yeah. And then it gets tricky and tricky and now you are here in the deep valley of the process. So this is step number three and also step number four. These uh, steps are really connected to each other and you cannot really separate them. But you really have to know that this is the normal process. So for getting out of this deep valley, you just have to go on. But how can you encourage yourself to go on when everything is so shit? <laughs> Relax and breathe. Try to remember this enthusiasm that you had at the beginning where everything was so awesome, your brilliant idea. Try to get back to this. 
and also focus on to the result because it will be awesome if you just go on and don't give up. So just relax and don't stick too much in details. If there's something that really annoys you, maybe in your costume, then just leave it or change it, take something else. If you can't go on with your routine, just change it. Sometimes these are the little things that when we change them, then everything will be so much easier. And yes, don't give up. Just make it to your everyday routine to work on your act. And it's okay if you don't have the same passion for it every day. Just see it as something normal you're doing every day. And be aware that this is the normal process. So then you go on and go on and one day you have finished your routine. And you have a performance with this. And you're asking yourself, mm, will the audience like it? And uh, now it's too late for changing something. I just have to do what I have prepared. When you are ready, you are getting an applause. And you think, this is awesome. My costume is amazing. My dance moves so sexy and the audience just loved it. Oh, I'm so happy, yeah. <laughs> and sooner or later, you have got another brilliant idea for a burlesque routine. And it starts all over again and again. And even if you think, and this time I will not feel shit about it, because now I know about the creative process, you will come to point three and four, where you feel shit about everything. But this is normal, just relax and proceed go on and even enjoy these feelings because this all belongs to your routine. At the end, every single burlesque routine is so much you because all your emotions that you can have are in this routine. So just enjoy it and have fun and relax and enjoy your wonderful routines at the end. Yes, and that's the six steps of the creative process. I hope I could help you with my video. If yes, give it a thumb up. And I would be happy if you subscribe to my channel. And see you next time. Bye.